beautiful souls, this is me, your Empress Soul Tarot. And right now, hindi po tayo magta-tarot, but we will calculate your life path number. So, ang life path number po, ito po yung total ng ating pangalan. Yes po, marami pong meanings, ang um, like mga numbers, marami pong mga meanings yan. Ang names natin, kung ikakalculate natin yan, eh may meaning din kung saan tayo mas magan mas um, mas mas saan tayo mas magaling, saan tayo ano ba talagang mission natin in this world. And of course, yung birthday din natin. So, kaya marami tayong mga zodiac signs, may iba-iba tayong mga elements. So, ngayon, ang, ang isa-start natin ay ang life path number natin. So, meaning to say, ito yung computation ng names natin. Okay. Kahit screen name, or code name, or kung anong tinatawag nila sa'yo, pwede mo din i-calculate, or kung ano yung gina mostly ginagamit mo. Okay? So, ito, all you have to do is you need you are going to write down your number. Write down ba? <laughs> okay, all you have to do is you need to have your your um, notebook and pen. So, right now, ang ginamit ko is itong board na to para mas malaki. So, we'll start with this. Okay? So, meron ako nilagay dito. Okay, 1, 2, 3, up to number 9. Okay, number 9 lang po tayo, ha? And then, um, try to um, write down yung, ano ba to? Uh, letters from A to Z. Okay, ang last sa Z is number 8. Okay, so dapat pantay, ha? Okay. Okay, so if you're done with this, so let's start sa name. Okay. So, pwede mo siyang i-check doon. Like, for example, my name is Cherry, by the way. Okay. So, kung hindi ito makompleto, we will start with... <clears throat> I'm going to continue this in part 2. So, here you go. Nilagay ko yung name ko na Cherry. So, kung anong nakatapat sa number, like for example, LC ay nakatapat siya sa number 3. H is nakatapat sa 8, so and so on. After this one, i-add nyo lang po. Okay? So, once na-add nyo na po, that's the time na sasabihin ko, i-reveal ko kung ano bang life path number. Um, by the way, yung number lang po ay up to 11 and up to 22. 2, 2 or 11, up to 9 lang po. Okay, number 9. <clears throat> Kung number 10 naman po. Hello beautiful souls. So ito po yung part 2 ng ating life path number. As I mentioned sa last video ko sa part 1, ang total number po natin, ibi-breakdown natin ay sa number 10. Um, nasa number, ang pinaka-last is number 9 lang po. Okay? Except sa number 11 and number 22. Okay. Pag yung total ama, ang total, total, pag na, yung total ng kinalculate is number 10, so 1 plus 0 is number 1 yung life path mo. Hindi lalapas siya sa 10. Kasi yung number natin, ang pwede lang is 9, 11, at 22. No? Okay? Kasi ang 11 at 22 is a master number. Yung mga 12, 13, so wala na po yun. Okay? So, right now, ang ginawa ko, sinulat ko na yung pangalan ko. Okay, magpapakilala na ako this time. So, this is my name. So, ang ginawa ko po, kailangan kumpleto, okay? And, and dito yung name mo, and then your family name. Okay lang na hindi mo na i-include yung middle name mo, okay? So, right ganito, Pinakauna is cherry. So, ang ginawa ko, in ko lang lahat nito. 3 plus 8 plus 5. And, ang total niya is 41. Now, hindi pwede na dalawa yung number, 2 digits. So, kailangan isa lang. So, i-add naman natin ang 4 plus 1 equals 5. Okay. Huwag po kayong mag-alala kasi hindi naman po ako magaling sa math. Pero, um, um, additional na lang naman to. Puro add lang, no? So, very simple lang talaga, no? So, ang total ng cherry ko is 5. Pero, ang importante na, malalaman natin ang 
Atong talagang life path mo is itong total ng buong pangalan mo. Take ito, tinotal ko to. So, ang total niya is 96. Now, 2 digits siya. So, kailangan ko i-add naman ang 9 plus 6 equals 15. So, 2 digits again. So, add mo na naman again. 1 plus 6, 5 equals 6. So, ang life path number ko is number 6. So, say... So, bibigyan ko kayo ng hint, no? Kasi hindi pa nag-aubos yung time natin. Ang number 5 po, kaya alam ko yung gift ko. Kasi ang number 5 po is to predict the future. You have the abilities na makapag, like, itong ginagawa ko, tarot. Kaya wala na po yung question doon. And then, the number 6, as, as my life path, yung total number ng... Hindi po ito yung life path nyo, ha? Ito ay may mga ibang meaning din. Compare din dito sa life path. It, ako po ay isang empath. Hello, beautiful souls. This is me, your empath soul tarot. So, um, kung ngayon nyo lang ako nakita, please follow nyo po ako for more spiritual learnings. And, and pwede nyo po akong i-follow din sa YouTube channel ko. Mas marami akong uploads doon. So, we'll be talking about life path numbers kung nag- tataka kayo, there are archetypes and life purpose. So, kung nagtataka kayo kung ano ba tong life path numbers. So, ito yung total ng names nyo or ang total ng um, birthdays nyo. So, maraming meanings po yan, no? So, pwede nyo pong i-google, pwede nyo pong um, tignan sa ibang mga um, talagang experts sa numerology, pero ito is a few lang, no? I-upload ko. So, nag-upload na ako ng dalawang videos on how to calculate your numbers. So, ito yung life purpose natin. So, kung an saan ba tayo mas magaling? Ano ba talagang mission natin in this world? Kung marami kayong tanong sa sarili nyo, saan kayo mas magaling? So, dito nyo po dapat i- um, i-calculate para mas malaman nyo kung ano talaga yung mission nyo in this world. So, um, i-explain ko na. So, life, if kung ikaw ay life path number one, you are the warrior, your life path needs you to take lead. So, meaning to say, you are the type of leader. So, karamihan sa mga life path number one, ikaw ay isang leader. No? Ang na nakita ko sa ibang tao dito ay mga mga politicians, yung um, talagang supervisors, managers, ganon. So, you are, you have the courage or optimism and the strength to guide the other people. Life path number two, harmonizers, your Tama ba to? Um, harmonizers. Your life path uh, needs you to love and be loved. So, meaning to say, kasi, um, minsan kasi yung to kasi is more on duality, partnership. So, ikaw talaga yung nag encourage sa ibang tao na mag, um, parang, parang, parang more on peacemaker din. Then, if you are also an motivator or creator and you are also the nurturer meaning to say mataas yung intuition nyo very yung psychic mo nagde-develop talaga if you are a life path number 3 the per, you are the performer your life path needs you to be seen so usually ito yung mga mga artist ito yung mga celebrities okay mga marunong kumanta sumayaw so depende kung ano yung Um, skills mo or saan yung talents mo. So, ang life path number 3 din kasi you are also a speaker kasi ang 3 is more on community um, more on community so you are a communicator or um, usually din ito yung mga uh, Hello beautiful souls! So, this is our part 2 sa life path numbers natin. Kung ano yung purpose natin in this world? Saan ba tayo mas magaling? Ano ba talagang um, skills or talents ang dapat natin gawin? So, natapos po ako sa life path number 3 which are which is about you are an artist, you could be a celebrity, you could be a songwriter or performer. So, nakalagay naman dito performer or you are um, um, speaker, ganun. Now let's let's move on for life path number four. So artists and the artists in your life path needs you to find stability. So ang four kasi it's more on home, it's more on family. So um 
more on ik parang ikaw yung parang um, problem solver ikaw yung nag uh, builder of old of the old order so ikaw yung talagang <laughs> nag naggather or ikaw yung nagsosolve ng mga problems when it comes to your family or mas um tutok ka sa family mo okay stabilizer builder success and wealth and prosperity okay so if you are also a life path number five the adventurer your life path needs you to find free uh find freedom okay ang five kasi in your morality it's more on changes no so um so ikaw yung mga usually na parang unending talent the unending talent daw and you also you are you want to challenge yourself you want to explore um gusto mong pumunta ng mga mountains or um you are motivate uh talagang motivation mo talaga and creativity mo ginagamit mo talaga so that is your life path number number six, you are the nurturer your life path needs you to nurture so uh usually ito yung nakikit yung nurturer kasi kasi ako I'm a, I'm a life path number six. uh ito yung mga nanay talaga no so kahit hindi ka ina so talaga ni ni nurture niyo yung friendship mo yung family mo talagang uh, kung especially yung love mo um you are respond you are the responsible one and you are the server no um, it doesn't mean na ikaw talaga yung mag, um, parang server sa restaurant. So, so, ikaw talaga yung parang healer ng lahat, no? Ikaw yung nagko-comfort, ikaw yung uh, may ability ka to heal other people. And, and usually, yung life path number six is mga empath. So, mala, dala, talagang nararamdaman yung, mo yung mga emosyon ng ibang tao na mal, or malalapit, or kung sino yung lumalapit sa'yo. Number seven, the seeker. Um, your life path needs you to speak out knowledge. So, karamihan din. Hello, beautiful souls. This is me, your Empress Soul. Now, this is our part 3 sa ating life path numbers. Their archetypes and life purpose. So, kung hindi mo alam kung ano yung purpose mo in this world, ano ba saan ka ba mas magaling? Ano ba talagang, ano ba talagang reason? Bakit ka nandito? So, you can check my other videos about this. So, nakapag-upload ako ng dalawang videos on how to calculate your numbers. So, pwede check it out. Okay, so natapos ako sa life path number 7 which is the seeker. You, I'm, I, yun yung last ko. Your life path needs you to seek out knowledge. So usually, ito yung life path, yung mga life path number 7, ito yung mga matatalino, matatalino talaga din, no? So ito yung mga about spirituality din. So sila yung the source of knowledge, sila yung expert and thinker or magaling silang mag-analyze and usually ito yung mga parang uh, sinasabi natin na um, perfectionist you know kasi matalino sila and they are also mystic and courage protection and they also have more wisdom now if you are a life path number eight you are the influencer your life path is to find ano ba to? find ways to achieve and prosper. So, usually, number 8, no? So, lagi ko itong sinasabi. Ang number 8 kasi, it's more on money. So, 8 is infinity sign din. So, you are born to be rich. You are born to be, um, alam mo na yun, parang, um, manifester din. Material manifester. So, kailangan mo ng mga, um, talagang extra money and the power, uh, the, the figure of authority, prosperity, and generosity. So, karamihan sa inyo is mga generous. Karamihan sa inyo is mga authority. So, may mga ranggo. Now, if you're in life path number 9, the sage. So, your life path is to hear um, the world through the embodied wisdom. So, ang life path number 9, it's more um you are the humanitarian and you are also um like we, they call it a shaman or rebellion or a clarity. So, maraming meanings po yan. Now, let's look up the life path number 10. Okay. Asan yung life path number 10? Okay. So, I'm number 10. Um, 11. So, hanggang 9 lang po siya. So, if you are a life path number 11, 2 
to, ay, hindi ko nakita dito yung 3-3. So, number 11, a uh, 1-1, or 2-2, or 3 you are, uh, this is are the master numbers. So, kah, huwag nyo na pong i-add to, ha? Okay. So, 11 is a numer uh, in illuminator. Your life path is a search for enlightenment. Number two, 22, or 2-2 is a visionary. Hello, beautiful souls. This is me, your Empress Soul. Now, we'll be talking about the life path number 4. This is our part Four na po. So, tapos ko na, na, uh, na, I mean, ano ba to? Na-explain ko na yung iba. And kung na, na guguluhan kayo, pwede nyo pong i-check yung dalawang videos na na-upload ko on how to calculate your number. At kung talagang naguguluhan pa rin kayo, you better check my YouTube channel. So, i, i um, iintak ko lahat to. Intak ba? So, talagang i-connect-connect ko lahat para maging full video siya. So, um, tapos na po ako sa 1 to 9. So, um, last na mention ko is ang, kung may, ikaw ay life path number 1, 1 or 11 or 2, 2 and 3, 3, which is wala dito. Um, i-mention ka na lang ito ay mga master number. So, meaning to say, malaki yung impact mo in this world. Malaki din yung mission mo. Or, talagang, it's more on astrology and more on shaman, more on spirituality, or uh, more, so, depende, no, kung saan kang life path. Pero, hindi naman lahat necessarily na ito, like, ito talaga yung sundan mo. Pero, mas better na ito talaga yung gawin mo kasi um, mas bi magbibigay sa'yo to na ang universe ay magbibigay sa'yo ng rewards kasi ito yung talaga yung mission mo. So, if you are a life path number 11, um, you are very um, intuitive ba to? Ano? Ah, intuitive ba to? <laughs> Uh, I, I hope I pronounce it right. So, ikaw din ay very psychic. So, marami kang, da, madali kang makasense din ng tao. So, pwede ka rin maging tarot card readers or depende kung ano yung gusto mo. Now, if you are life path 22, you are um material and humanity master. Life path number 33 is, spir is spiritual teacher. So, depende yan. Iba-ibang spiritual teacher. Maaring marunong ka sa mga um... Um, ha, ha, more on halaman, more on um, more on numbers. So something about spiritual, no? Um, ano pa to? Must still be there powerful, okay? So if you have any questions, pwede ko pa pong i-upload yung talagang full talaga, no? Kung ano talaga mga meaning nito ng life path 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So ako, I'm a tarot card reader, pero, pero I'm an Life path number 6, which is the nurturer. And ito ay about empath. So, kung ano yung nararamdaman mo, nasisense ko din yun. Nararamdam ko din yun. Kaya minsan din distance ako yung sarili ko. So, I hope may mga natutunan kayo dito. And I hope you can follow me and subscribe sa mga YouTube channel ko po. At sa TikTok, channel, TikTok account. Bye!